here's an extra tip when it comes to the magic E. Um, when children are either first learning the magic E or if they are uh, having trouble applying the rule, then I give them this extra visual cue in their primary phonics readers. So, for example, if your child gets to the word cute, but they say cut, I would say, oh, what do you see on the end of this word? And I circle it. And they might say magic E at that point. If they don't, I'll give them a hint. I'll say, it's a magic. And then they'll probably say E. And I'll say, what does the magic E do? It jumps over the letter next to it. It waves its wand and it says to the vowel, say your long name. So this isn't a uh anymore. What's the long vowel name of this vowel? And then they might say U. And if they don't, then I'll list the options for them. I'll say, is it A, E, I, O, or U? So then they would choose U and I'd say, now remember, the magic E doesn't make a sound. Let's sound out this word again with the U sound. And k, ute, cute. So at that point, you've given them extra visual assistance. Um, you don't have to go through this whole process every time. Probably as you move along, you can just simply do the visual part when you get to the word if they're pausing and not getting the word immediately, and that will be enough of a cue for them to realize, oh, it's a magic E word. So if you're, they're reading, and we must not let the wax drip on the kit ack cat. I just like do this, oh, and then they might get it right away at the circle. I might have to draw the arrow, but either way, as they practice, they'll get more proficient at it and eventually need smaller visual cues, cues and then none at all. So uh, you could go through their primary phonics book and do this in advance to every magic E word. Um, but I usually enjoy doing it as I go with the kids because I think it's more impactful. But say, for example, if it's the second time you're doing it, then you might just go through the whole book in advance and circle all the magic E's. All right, have a great day.